What's up, guys? Second Cooper over here, back again with some more Kirby's Mod in Minecraft. Oh, yeah, so first off, we got started with Industrial 4 going, and we dismantled some Apex gear from Apotheosis. Between episodes, I was um, debugging something that was kind of weird. So when I, when I started up the world, my modular router wasn't sending plastic to that drawer, and I was debugging it for, like, I don't know, 20 minutes or something? Er, maybe 10 minutes? I have no idea. But the point is... I was about to submit a bug report to modular routers, but then somehow it fixed itself because, um, because the plastic wasn't stacking. And honestly, I have no idea what, uh, I have no idea what fixed it. So yeah. Anyway, uh, this episode, I want to try to get, now I want to try to get the, uh, the mob farms up and running so that way I can progress further in industrial foregoing. So I have a dissolution chamber here ready. I also uh, I also added some more cables right here so that way I could uh, you know do that. And for now, uh, for now I think I'll have the ender tanks uh, for the industrial foregoing fluids up here. Later I will have those connected uh, via storage bus. But for now I want to do that because one of the things I want to do. I want to get an enchantment extractor so that way I can get magnetic off of my leggings because uh, because magnet is extremely annoying. I really do not like magnet. I want I want to get rid of that as soon as possible. So in order to do that, I mean I have a mob slaughter factory. Oh wait, I'm gonna need a range add-on, like range add-on tier two. Let's see, range add-on. Think yeah, I think I'm gonna need that one. So. So four lapis, two glass panes, two redstone. All right, let's see. Four lapis, two redstone, uh, two glass panes. All right. Uh, didn't I have a bucket? Uh, where's my bucket? Uh, didn't I have a bucket? Or did I use it? I have no idea if I used it. Point is, it's not over here. Um, I have no idea where it is. Because it's not in my backpack. It's not in the AE system. I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened, and that's annoying. Which means I'm going to need to make a new bucket. Yay. I'll be right back. All right. Well, since my bucket is nowhere to be found, might as well just uh, do that. So let's see. It, it it's not exactly shapeless, but you know. Here we go. One range out on tier two, ready to go for the mob slaughter factory. This will get me my pink slime. I'm also going to need to set up a timer based system to get uh, to uh, to make the the golden egg, uh, the delightful dirt. Yeah, I'm gonna need to set up a timer to to trigger like dispensers to pour water on that so that way the uh, that way all the vegetation that grows there inevitably is gone now i did i this did actually i did actually uh, notice this but didn't make my mob mashers yet how many diamonds do i have okay i still have plenty so that's good so let's go ahead let's go ahead and get a couple of these going. Oh, and I'm also gonna need, probably gonna want sharpness, which is gonna need a lot more iron. And uh, then we're gonna need looting. Uh, that's actually, that's actually should be fine. So, yeah, this should be fine. Like, uh, looting, uh, looting is no problem. Oh wait, I'm gonna need more of these. Um, Okay, yeah, I didn't even think about uh, crafting these yet, so that's on me. I'll be right back. Okay, so uh, I set up my crushing wheels again because I need I need to crush these in order to get some materials. I'm literally out of iron, so I'm hoping I can get some from this iron horse armor. As you may also notice, wait, as you may also notice, I took off my leggings so that way uh, so that way I don't have an incident where my leggings will cause the items to get voided. So, yeah. Maybe I should get a chute. Where are all my chutes? 
Uh, did I? Oh, I used them as... I used them to make portable storage interfaces. Of course. All right, well, I guess I'm taking off my magnet as well, just so nothing gets voided. Just to be safe. Because I do not want anything getting voided. All right, I'll be right back as soon as all this horse armor is uh, crushed. That was weird. The string wasn't condensing into one stack for some reason. And it's been, it's been happening. It, that's, I think that's what happened. I think that's what happened to the, uh, uh, to my plastic earlier. Like it, like it wasn't, it wasn't recognizing it, it wasn't recognizing it as the same item. But it's working, so it's working now? <sighs> I don't know, man. Uh, item handling is weird. Maybe it's a maybe it's a forge bug. There was a forge update recently. Yeah, there was a forge update recently. Maybe it's a forge bug. Oh my god. Do not pick those up, please. All right. So I'm pretty sure this is not enough iron. So let's see. We got a lot of gold. Hold on. How much iron do I have? Ninety three. Well, in order to get the max sharpness on both of uh, on both of these mob mashers, I mean that would kill any enemy in one hit. Um, in order to get max sharpness, I would need ten of these, which is four swords per. So that would be eighty iron, which is a very long way to say that I am short on iron and I'm out of raw. So I'm going to need to go mining. Yay, I'll be right back. You gotta be kidding me. A silverfish spawner? Oh my god. That's gonna be annoying. I better get rid of this now. Go away. Who knows how many... Who knows how many uh, bugs they've already blocked... Uh, who knows how many blocks they've already bugged? Okay, well, now I need to check, like, every block around here, considering there's a silverfish spawner. And silverfish spawners apparently do not respond to light. Great. All right, what do we, what do we have in the chest? I should probably get rid of some of this. Silverfish chart fragments? Oh, that's actually pretty good. Mostly because uh, silverfish are very annoying. Hmm. Yeah, you know... This is this is decent loot. Uh oh. Oh, it's a husk. Okay. Also, it's an uncommon boss, so this is a lot easier than some of the other ones. Okay. What do we get from that? Stalwart laying uh, stalwart leather pants of gravity. Or did I get that from the creeper? No, I think I got this from that creeper. But I'm not sure. Oh, here it is. Eddie's Berserking Ferris Truncator of the God King. <laughs> what a mouthful. All right, what else we get? Anything interesting? Here. Tablet of Binding. Huh. Is this for familiars? I think it's for familiars. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Get a Breach Gem. Sourceberry. Nice. Oh my god, another Lexicapitania? Dude, I cannot... I cannot escape these things. Oh my god. Yeah, I cannot escape these things. Get out of my inventory. Alright. I think it's uh, guaranteed that those will be... Uh, that, that'll be coming back to me. Alright. Um, I'll be right back. Yeah. Yeah, I found I found a lot of stuff, uh, including some stuff that I just. Oh, did I find this bucket? While... I must have found that bucket while I was down there. Either that, or I had that bucket beforehand. Either way, um, I have a bunch of stuff that I need to put in chests. Uh, also, a, also another cabbage seed. Uh, also more cabbage seeds, like uh, like I didn't have enough of those, and also man in a bottle. Yay. 
All right, uh, give me just a second. Well, I guess I better drink this man in a bottle because uh, there's no other use for it. So, oh, <laughs> culinary mycelial generator. It produces nothing. Of course. Why, uh, hold on. Why is it? Why can it be used in here if it does nothing? Yeah, whatever. Didn't seem to do anything. Hmm. Oh, great. Love that. Love that for me. Almost killed me and uh, gave me my head. Now I have to use a bunch of... Okay. Night vision? For five minutes? Did that restore a bunch of health? I think it did. Oh. Well then, uh, I'm up here now. Why did you do this to me? Okay, let's just drink the rest of it up here. Okay. Cool. Thanks. Thanks, love that. Love that for me. Yeah, okay. Oh, I actually have a bunch of head. And then I just have a generic player head. I'm not sure why. Player damage plate. Causes player damage to anything that walks on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. A player head with Curse of Binding on it can be put on an armor stand to display that player's full body. Huh. Having a witch kill a named snow golem will drop the player head matching the golem's name. Uh, okay, that's interesting. Hmm. Alright, well, uh, I... Need to eat a god burger, and I need to I need to uh, process a bunch of this iron that I got. So yeah, I'm gonna need yeah I'm gonna need like 80 swords, so 160 iron. Let's see, I have 93. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so I got the mob master upgrades for sharpness, and now I could probably do the yeah I could I could definitely do that. So I have looting as well. That'll be great. This is going to be great. Beheading. Hmm. Do I want that? Do I need it? I don't know. I don't know if I need it. Who knows? I may have enough. Also, why did this... What is that? Why did that not look like my skin for a second there? It looked like Alex. Hmm. Eh, whatever. Uh, I don't think I need the mom asher. Uh, I don't think I need the beheading upgrades. Um, so really, really what I need to do now is I need to sleep through the night. And then I need to find a place to put these farms. So that way I can, oh, I need fans for the, uh, okay. Actually, we're not, we're not quite done yet. Not quite done yet. I need two dispensers. Uh, yeah, I need a couple of dispensers. Oh, and I need to disable one of these recipes. Um, hmm. Maybe I should disable the. Maybe I should disable this uh, cyclic recipe. Yeah, give me just a second. Okay, we got a couple of dispensers. Now let's get some buckets. Oh, I only have a couple buckets. Awesome. Okay, what kinds of timers do we have? Oh, uh, we only have RF tools. Okay. Uh, don't use the compressed stone, please. Oh, let's see, stone. Hold on. Can can this be crafted? Okay, so you can pressurize. You can pressurize anything in the balm stones. Tack. Uh, is compressed stone used for a whole lot? I don't think so. Um. I'm gonna be eating my words if I need compressed stone for anything else, but you know, I might, I might as well just use stone that I have. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so first things first, we have a timer. Now I just need to. Uh, I wanted. I want to do. Uh, I want to do wireless redstone with this because I kind of want those to go off simultaneously. So transmitter. We're okay. So we're gonna need more gold nuggets, which yeah, that should be fine. Uh, then we're going to need two torches. 
Okay. Ugh. Stone. Stone. Here you go. Let's make a two machine bases because I need a transmitter and then a receiver. Oh wait, I need two receivers. Shoot. So one more of these. Gold. Yeah. Uh, so then we need a few compact, uh, then we need a few comparators. Okay, well, let's see. Uh, so, uh, yeah. So like 12 of these and then shoot stone there we go that should be good there we go so that so that should be it should be all uh, it should be all she wrote um fans i need fans oh shoot shoot i need a let's see at mob fan all right, so we're gonna need stone slabs. We're gonna need three of these. So I think, yeah, definitely gonna need more iron. So four, eight, 12. Yeah, that should be fine. Uh, I'll be right back. There we go. Three mob fans. Now I just need some levers. Uh, I'm actually not sure how many we need. I need cobble though. Uh, here's my dank. Yeah, sweet. No, bag mode. Not sure how many levers we... Oh, okay, so let's see. We need one, two for the... Hmm. So we need two for the mashers. Uh, three for the fans. Let's see, two for the mashers, three for the fans. Uh, three for the... Three for the lamps. So, eight of them. Man, if you uh, okay, if you can hear if you can hear the rain, oh boy. Better better make sure that storm isn't serious, because I I would like to finish a recording tonight. So uh, yeah, be right back. You know, I also totally forgot about width upgrades. Um, those would probably be a little useful. Just a little. Oh my god. And, and okay, so I think I think I know I think I know what this bug is. So. Uh, so items in containers uh, seem to not have, they uh, seem to not know like what they're, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. It seems like a forge bug though. So yeah, I think I, I think I need to, I think I need to take a look at the forge GitHub and see what's going on. Cause uh, yeah, that's an annoying bug. But yeah, uh, let me, let me go ahead and make, uh, let me go ahead and make the, uh, uh, the width upgrades that I need, and I'll be right back. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and plop a fan here, just so I can, uh, just so I can verify. Let's see. Yeah. So if we do this, perfect. Exactly what I thought. Man, this does not pick up quickly. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! It's doing that thing again, dude. God, I really, I really, really hope that uh, that the Forge team knows about this bug. I better go check the GitHub right now. Okay, so bad thing is, uh, there is that uh, I don't see a bug already on GitHub. So, yeah, that's that's gonna be annoying. That's gonna be annoying to fix, but you know. All right. Um, I need to, I need to pick a place to put these, uh, I'm gonna put these farms, uh, these, uh, mob farms anyway. Um, oh, and I need, I need ender tanks. I need more ender tanks, I just realized. Uh, I'm gonna need, I'm gonna need one for, yeah, well, actually, I think I just need one ender tank, like, for pink slime. And that's really it. Really, I don't care too much about liquid meat, so let's get an ender tank. Uh, well, let's get two ender tanks. Uh, let's make them pink, because why not? Hold on, don't I have uh, don't I have like a peony? I do. Okay, so yeah, a couple of pink dye. Then we just need some wool. 
Don't have any. I do have plenty of string, though, which is good. Nope. Air. That. Alright. Ender tank. Okay, we need some obsidian. Um, I'll be right back. Alright. Got a couple of pink, pink, pink ender tanks. So, we'll just put that there for the time being. Again, we'll move it later. For now, though, I... Let's see. Uh, laser. Laser node. Perfect. And then we're going to need a flux point. Let's see. Oh, you got to be kidding me. All right. Let's see. Uh, do you still have blaze powder? Perfect. Uh, then we're just going to need obsidian. I really need to get obsidian automated. Yeah, this is just getting to be annoying. Um, can, can you just like, uh, oh, I don't know put items where they should be going instead of, instead of like, instead of separating the stacks, that'd be great. Cause, uh, yeah. Okay. So that's working now. Um, I think this is working just fine. Um, you know, I, if I, if I find anything else, I can, I can fix it. I don't need to do it on camera, mostly because it's a little annoying to do so. All right, so where was I? Right, I was I was trying to figure out what cards I needed. So I have like three, I have three fluid cards in here. And that's when I found out my redstone wasn't stacking properly. So let's see, card. I need, uh, I need two energy cards. So let's see, uh, redstone. Yeah, I need two of these. So, oop, hold on. Uh, one of these needs to be extract. And then, no, not that. Okay, one of these needs to be extract. Oh, but I need a filter. Let's see, uh, filter. Um, if I remember correctly, filters are a little broken. Let's see, pink slime? If I remember correctly, pink slime is a little broken in, or uh, fluids are a little broken in here, yeah. Yeah. I don't know what I don't know what's going on, but fluids are broken. So, yeah, this should be showing the fluid instead of the bucket, but it's showing the bucket. I have no idea what's going on with that. Yeah, I have no idea why this is doing this. It's it's very annoying, and uh, I know uh, I know it's uh, I know it's a little annoying for Dyer as as well because. Uh, it's an unresolved bug in 119 and 120 development has started. So, yeah. I don't know what's going on with that. Hmm. You know, I also just realized. Oh my god. How do I always realize stuff after I after I'm ready to build this? I need I need absorption hoppers. I'll be right back. All right, absorption hoppers are ready. I feel like I may need a, I feel like I may need an ender tank for experience. Speaking of experience, I added a mod recently. Experience Obelisk. This is basically the experience obelisk from Ender.io just in 119. And Ender.io is getting a 120 version, so hopefully, hopefully we can have uh, like the experience obelisk from Ender.io back. But until then, we have this. So, yeah, this it, this stores experience in the form of a cognition, which eh, you know. I I also added this tooltip: do not use the cognition bucket in crafting. You will lose the bucket. I have tested this and I have tried to fix it. I cannot fix it. Do not use the cognition bucket. I swear to you, do not use it. That will be a waste of iron. <laughs> like I swear to you, you will lose it. You'll lose that bucket. All right, so let's figure out where I want to put a mob farm. Maybe up there. Yeah, maybe up there, like a little far away. Uh, I should probably also get an ender chest. Good thing I have one already. And maybe hold on. 
I should get I should get another laser. Uh, I think I need to get another laser node or something. Um, at laser. Yeah, maybe just give me a second. Okay, so I just prepped a couple more things. I have uh, I have uh, two item extract cards. Uh, I have them separated because you can't put card overclockers in stacked cards. So yeah, uh, these are both set to uh, extract 64 items a tick and this item insert card will insert them into the ender chest, which will then be sorted appropriately. I'm probably gonna wanna put some node overclockers on that uh, on that laser node down there and uh, uh, and more item extract cards. So that way that can extract up to nine items a tick or nine stacks a tick, so. Th uh, that will be much better than uh, than the last series where it seems like it was getting bottlenecked a lot, but you know, it's it's fine. So yeah, let's go ahead and get these mob farms going up here. Probably like uh, probably like in the hill, like over here. Oh shoot! I need tinted glass. Forgot about that. Forgot about tinted glass. All right, I need some tinted. Uh, yeah, I, I want some. Uh, I want some tinted ethereal glass uh, before we move on. So let's see, tinted. Tinted glass. It, well, no, I want tinted ethereal. So we're gonna want eight tinted glass and an eye of ender. There's also phantom glass from uh, uh, from Zycraft, but I need either coarse fruit or phantom membranes. So that's not amazing. So, so dark glass viewer. That's a uh, stone cutter. All right. Yeah, phantom membrane. Not amazing. Not amazing considering I haven't seen phantoms at all. And also coarse fruit. Can't uh, can't get to the end right now. So uh, we're gonna stick with the ethereal glass. Let's just go ahead and make some. Uh, oh, I need I need um, shoot. Let's see, so tinted ethereal glass. We need tinted glass, which needs, how much amethyst do I have? Ooh, I don't have, a, I don't have as much amethyst as I, as I thought I did. Okay, I just went to go get some amethyst, and uh, yeah, that's uh, got quite a bit. And it's not stacking, yay. Love that for me. All right, is, now is it, it's not, Still not stacking. Oh my god. That's that's annoying. Oh my god. Okay, I this is gonna be super annoying. There we go. Now they're the same. At least I'm hoping they are. I'm just gonna drop this on the ground and see what happens. Okay, good. They're they're the same. Alright. I was really hoping that was gonna be the case. Man, that was annoying. All right, let's make some tinted glass. Uh, now that I have a bunch of amethyst. And now we just need to make this ethereal. So let's see. Uh, ender. Where, where's my, where are my eyes of ender? Didn't I make those already? Oh, no, wait, uh, maybe I didn't. Let's see. Tinted. Nope, uh, tinted ethereal. Uh, I don't think I made these yet. Eh, which is fine. All right, and we have some tinted ethereal glass. Now I just need to sleep through the night again because I, yeah. Yep, that's a thing. All right, let's go ahead and finally build some mob farms. That would probably, probably be a good thing to do. You know, mob drops. Pretty helpful. But maybe, maybe I should figure out what I'm getting and put it in drawers before I, uh, before I like collect stuff. Mm, actually, here's, here's an idea. Here's an idea. Let's get a, let's get a barrel. Let's get one of my diamond barrels. Let's see, uh, barrel. Might as well just get one of my diamond barrels so that way I can, uh, that way I can just, keep stuff on me, or keep stuff in there while I sort through everything and see what I get. And uh, yeah, let's see. So we're gonna need, 
Actually, do I want to do this completely in the hill? I, I mean, I guess I can. I guess I can. Uh, so, yeah. We're going to need a 5x5 five five space inside. And then for the... Uh, okay, so... How about over here we can do, like, hostile mobs or something? Maybe I can do... Maybe I could do them all in a row. I think uh, I think the the important thing then is going to be that I need uh, I need those I need those fans going. Oh, actually, the fans should be the fans should be no problem. Um, so yeah, um, maybe maybe just let me dig and I'll be right back because this is going to take a little bit. Okay, I just downgraded Forge to the previous version. Hopefully that fixes whatever item weirdness is going on, but it I'm not hopeful. It I've been dealing with the I've been dealing with the item weirdness for so long and it's so annoying. I'm really hoping I'm really hoping that it's fixed because uh, I don't want to deal with it anymore. Now back to the regularly scheduled program, which is building this. But that is the wrong keybind. But here's the thing. I think I'm going to want to do it like here because of chunk boundaries. Everyone's favorite. Eh, everyone's favorite when they're playing modded. Got to do eh, Got to pay attention to those. God dang chunk boundaries. But maybe. Yeah, how about we do how about we do the hostile farm over here and then maybe the passive farms over here? Yeah, that should be fine. Um, that should totally be fine. Uh, and I mean, it's right next to the tree farm, but it's whatever. I had a, I had my tree farm right next to my mob farm in the last series, so it's fine. Anyway, uh, I will get digging, and I'll be right back.